Hello, hello, hello. Today we will be talking about. Today we'll be talking about README files or documenting your code, depending on how you want to call it. So we will. So you see, this is an example. So you see, this this code is already quite busy with lots of comments right here, even though it's fundamentally the code does very little. So wouldn't it be nice to have everything on one screen? So then have a different page, so, so to say, to read all these or any requirement, any documentation you want to leave for for yourself in the future or for whoever that uses that will use the code, right? So let's go ahead and do that so for example here is a new file so if you have a simple project like this serial begin six okay so I believe this is how to declare that doesn't look right again here so now you could print hello. Let's go ahead and print line. Okay. So say you have this you know super complicated code here. <laughs> I know. So now you could save it. Oh no, you can save this code. Let's save it on my desktop. So we'll call it a um, code with doc. All right. So now to create your extra file. So this is what I tip typically do. I wonder if there's an easier way to do it. Um, the way I do it is a little bit strange. So what I do, I will close out of this. So this is my code here. So remember we saved it on a desktop open it so this is the main code so what I will do is go ahead and create a text file here but then call it readme the more instead of a text file it will be a dot h file right this way Arduino ID knows to bring it into the project so when I open it up I open up my code it will actually bring this file into the project like this see so you can do all your documentation here so you could say uh, maybe your you could say maybe your requirement you know and so most connect a uh, um, Arduino board to the computer. All right. Then most. Then maybe you can name it number one, number two. Um, um to the only requirement for this code because this is just a print line. Though you could say usage. You could say usage. Usage. Um, connect. And Arduino code, Arduino board to PC. Um, upload, upload code, and open, open um, serial monitor to see. Me save it. All right. So that's that. Let's say this is all the documentation that we want to do. You could do. You could if you if you used like a, an Arduino library. You could you could say here. Yeah, you know used. Or you could just call it a title install. Um, packages. Or library 
place you know then you can name it here although that might not be necessary because you know you will have to include it here but all right so yeah i will save it save everything then go ahead and upload our code to the arduino i have arduino uno connected right now oh this needs to be a string i always do this <laughs> all right upload it All right, now we can open up the monitor, serial board monitor. Our board rate is 9600, and we are printed, right? All right, that's all I have for today. I hope that was useful. Um, go ahead and give us a subscription <laughs> or subscribe to our channel. Uh, give us a like if this was useful to you. But yeah, when you close it, and this code will always live here with this. Whenever you open it, the document or documentation will still be there and you could make this as big or as huge as you want you know and you'll be good all right i will talk to you later bye bye